always getting high, always and forever, party till we die. Always getting crazy, always getting high, always and forever, party till we die. Hello everybody and welcome back to another Battlefront 2 tutorial on how to install the Star Wars Battlefront 3 Legacy mod by Alpha Brucio and Anakin. So what you first gotta do is actually download the 2.2 gigs uh, as, as long as you have your up-to-date version 1.1 and version 1.3 patches, which I'm pretty sure most of you already do have. So once you actually do download this, you can just actually X that out, minimize it, and then you want to go to your WinRAR or whatever you have to get the files so you have your audio and your pages, your four maps, and your two .lvls. So what you d do at that point is you go to where your file path for your Battlefront 2 folder is, in which case mine would be for the disk version, Program Files 86, LucasArts Battlefront 2 Game Data Add-on, but for the Steam version, I believe it was it was Program Files 86, Steam, Steam Apps, Common, Star Wars Battlefront 2. And now what you want to do now is go to your install, get rid of your audio and pages. You can overwrite them if you want to, but I'm not going to do that. Yeah, the audio one and the pages one, you remove both of these, or you can just replace them because there are backups that come with this, but I don't need them. Then you just put your audio and pages in your install folder. Good to go. And then you want to go to your game data, your add-on, and put your four folders in. And once your four folders are in, you should be fine. After that, you got your four folders. You see they're in your add-on folder. Now go to your data, your level PC, and now you have these last two .lvl files. You just want to drag them into your level PC and they'll go in there and you'll be good to go. Might take a while for me, I don't know why. So you got your Custom Galactic Conquest and user script. And now you should be good and launch up the game. Go into your instant action and choose whatever map you want. We'll just do Dantooine on the Team Deathmatch mode for Galactic Civil War. So then you just select the map you want, and you launch it. And to show you that it actually works, I will wait the whole minute it takes my computer to load up the actual game itself because this computer is old. To show you that this is actually how you do it, I won't just say, okay, that's it, goodbye, after I show you, because people will think, oh, I, I just bullshitted it, even though I didn't. Like I said, if you have a faster computer than this, it should be loaded up by now. But if you have a computer from the early 2010s like me, then you're not going to have a very good wait. You yeah, see, then you have your team deathmatch mode here, choose whatever team you'd like, spawn in, and I wish you the best of luck on playing the game. Alright, so uh, thank you all for watching this tutorial video, and goodbye.